I'm Peter McKenna. I'm the chef owner of the Gannett restaurant here in Glasgow. I'm also an ambassador for Maple from Canada. Wonderful ingredients, pleasure to use. We set up this restaurant so we could use the, the wonderful seasonal ingredients we have up here in Scotland. So the connection to the, the land and the sea and the seasons is paramount in everything we do. We use a lot of seaweeds in our cooking. When the mushroom season comes in and the game season comes in, we embrace that wholeheartedly. And whenever we can get red deer, we'll put it on the menu. It's, it's a fantastic product and it's near enough available all year round. So today we've got the Gia halibut. It's completely sustainable. I use the maple sugar in the curing process and it's a short cure. So I only cure it for four hours. I then put it into a smoking chamber and after 20 minutes, I brush it with dark maple syrup, leave it in there for another 20 minutes and then I'll brush it again with some more dark maple syrup, leave it for 20 minutes and then take it out to rest. Then I'll slice it for service. We've got sea trout from Loch Melford. On top of this, we've got a mixture of peas, cucumbers, trout roe and herring roe and we've made a beautiful bisque and we've got a lot of the maple vinegar in there lifts the whole dish brings it all together absolutely wonderful combination we've got beautiful short horn beef so to garnish our beef today we've got a smoked mayonnaise and we've got some hen of the woods maitake mushrooms a real smoky woody character to them for these we make a madeira and maple pickle so on top of the beef, we've got these beautiful mushrooms, we've got crisp shallots, and we got uh, toasted almonds. So you got a lot of crunch going through there. you got the rich, unctuous meat, that smoke coming through from the mayonnaise, and then that woody character from the mushrooms and the maple topping it all off. As I mentioned, I love to have deer on the menu. With this dish, we've cooked the beetroots in maple syrup and rose vinegar. And with the deer itself, we started a pan of foaming butter um, with lots of herbs in there and lots of garlic in there. And then we finished that on the barbecue, giving it that beautiful charred exterior and adding lots of smoke to the dish. Beautiful dish. Also in our sauce, we use all the bones from the deer and then we finish the sauce with a little bit of maple vinegar just to bring it all together again. Nice acidity, nice spice, beetroots and deer, I love that. So for pre-dessert, so we've got these wonderful strawberries from Fife. We've made a set cream so we got a strawberries around set cream and then it's a little bit of fennel ice cream. And to finish it all off, we've got this wonderful maple pecan cake with roasted peach and maple ice cream and a, a maple gastric over the ice cream just to top it all off. I love to use maple. We do a tasting menu, so it's very important to balance all these dishes. And with the maple, the depth of flavor, it's just astonishing.